Hello. I'm so tired, so much more aware. So we're gonna try and actually beat this game today and hope that the game doesn't BS us. Cause that'll be great. Because it just keeps spawning multiple people. And it gets annoying. For the Republic! For the Republic! Ray. He really, really drive me crazy. You <laughs> got my hand. Then you understand all you hang around. I see what's going down. <laughs> you never... <laughs> oh, I'm in any <laughs> Feel better now. She falls in the bed. Yes. What? Of course. Da 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 I hope I'm going the right way. Oh, it looks like I am. Yes. Hopefully. More or less. Yeah. 
Hey, Johnny, could you move? You're kind of in the way. What is it? Sure. Yes? What is it? That you need? Yes? Hmm? No, 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 no. Oh, okay. Yes. That. Oh. <laughs> Did you not? For the order! Oh, it's best Tila. Revan, I knew you'd come for me. Hello. I never give up on you, best Tila. You're wasting your time. I've seen the Jedi for what they are weak and afraid. The Sith are the true masters of the Force. You've forgotten that lesson, Revan. Now you must pay the price. Here on the Star Forge, the power of the dark side is at its strongest. This time, you will not defeat me. Another one. Oh, hey. That's fine, guys. Don't worry, I got this. So, first off. Immune? I see now why Malak followed you. Even though you're only a shell of the Force self, you're still a formidable opponent. I can't even imagine the power you must have wielded when you were the Dark Lord. You were a fool to give it all up and follow the light side. I'm as strong in the light as I ever was following the dark side. You've been consumed by the dark side, Bastila. Can't you see it's destroying the you? The dark side has made me stronger than I ever was before. I have a greater command of the Force than all but the most powerful Jedi Masters. As Malak teaches me the greatest secrets of the Sith, I will unlock more of my potential. Eventually, there'll be no limit to what I can accomplish with the Force. <laughs> 
Um, no, Malak will never let you become that powerful. He'll kill you first. I've forgotten the ways of the Sith already, Revan. Eventually, I will challenge my master. If I am worthy, he will die by my hand, and I will become the new Sith master. Then I will take on my own apprentice, and the cycle will begin again. This is the way of the Sith. It is how we assure our leaders are always the strongest and most worthy. You're dooming yourself to an endless cycle of death and betrayal. No, Revan. It is you who are doomed. I'm not sure about that, Bastila. <laughs> I think I just killed myself. Now nah, we're good. You're growing weary. I can sense it. Your strength falters. The light side is failing you while the power of the Star Forge re energizes me. Soon this will all be over. Then strike me down, Basil. I want to defend myself. What type of trick is this? You're not evil, Basil. We meant to and uh, we meant something to each other once. I don't believe you will strike me down. I am a Sith apprentice now. You place too much faith in what I used to be, and for that, you shall pay. You shall fall. This is not possible. You're a little you close there. The dark side. You are a weak and pathetic servant of the light. How can you still stand against me? Why can't I defeat you? Hey, what's up, Kay? You are indeed first. Yes, I see you speak the truth. I'm no match for you. Please, for the sake of what we once shared, do not make me suffer. End my life quickly. There is no other way. I can never kill you, Bastila. What other choice do you have? I have fallen to the dark side. I am the apprentice to the Dark Lord himself. You cannot let me live. I was redeemed, Bastila. You can be, too. You were a special case. The Council had no other choice. They needed you alive so they could discover the location of the Star Forge. It was an act of desperation. It was my responsibility to watch over you. To make sure you did not slip back into your evil ways. I was supposed to protect you from the dark side. Can't protect me. Or you did more than protect me, Bastila. It's true I possess feelings for you. But was it only an illusion brought about by our bond? And what was the cost? I will Please. not break. This is too painful. Mm -hmm. End it now, quickly. There is no other way. I love you, Bastila. I can't abandon you forever. Are you ever? There is nothing in my heart but the blackness of the dark side. I'm sick of your preaching, Revan. I ask you for an honorable death, but you are too weak to even grant me that. Yes, I could join you in your battle against the Dark Lord. That alone would not make up for all I have done. Yet it would be a step in the right direction. But how would you be able to trust me? How do you know I wouldn't turn on you when you face Darth Malak? How do you know the dark side wouldn't make me betray you again? I trust you enough to leave myself open to your attack, Bastila. You play a dangerous game. Are you certain you wish to take this risk? I could end your life and gain Malak's favor with a single stroke of my lightsaber. You won't. <laughs> you are brave, and some would say foolish. But you are also right. The dark side has not wholly consumed me. I cannot raise my blade against you. You will go on to defeat Malak. Of this I have little doubt. He will have gone from being the Sith Lord himself to the savior of our galaxy. And you said you loved me. This may not be the best time to say it, but I love you too, with all my heart. Oh. After this? No. Nothing could make me feel safer than to be loved by you. You should go. Malak awaits. This isn't over yet. For any of us. I should stay here, though. 
If we face Malak, I am afraid his dark presence will overwhelm me. It would not be wise to expose myself to such temptation. Use your battle meditation to help the Republic. Yes, that would be for the best. You don't need me to defeat Malak anyway. Now I understand that a true Jedi is a match for any Sith, even the Dark Lord himself. I will stay here in this chamber and use my battle meditation to aid the Republic fleet. I am their only hope of destroying the Star Forge and ending the Sith menace. You must go and face Malak, but you have to hurry. Once I turn the battle in the Republic's favor, we won't have much time to escape the Star Forge before it's destroyed. Good luck, my love, and may the Force be with you. Yay! Pre redeemed Bastila! Or at least put her on the right track to do so. And we also got the uh, Republic Fleet, the uh, Battle Meditation. Break in the Sith formations. Green Squadron, move in. Green Squadron, moving in. Aw, snap. Green Squadron is through. We've broken their lines. Aw, snap. Basil is no longer using her battle meditation against us. The tide has turned. Red Squadron into the breach. It's funny, this song actually kind of fits this scene. The Sith fleet is in disarray. Now's our chance. Hit the starboard with everything you've got. God, I was really close to dying. I was at 1 HP. gonna be so upset if the glitch happened again where i couldn't move oh i would have been so upset but now i gotta be careful though because now i'm by myself i wish i could have gotten revan's outfit but there was just so many people that kept spawning there was no chance to go all the way down there grab it and then run all the way back up I mean, maybe I can go back now and get it, maybe? But, nah, it's alright. Oh, hey, Malik. How you doing? Ungod. Rip. I tire of this game, Revan. You have been a thorn in my side from the moment I seized the mantle of Dark Lord from your feeble grasp. You made a mistake coming here, Revan. The Star Forge fuels my command of the dark side. You are no match for me here, and this time you will not escape. Oh, is that right? Is that what you call it? You think stripping away your power and your identity was an act of bam, mercy, bam, Revan? Bam, bam. I would rather die. Bam, ba, da, 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 da. Spoken like a true slave of the Jedi Code. Save your preaching, Revan. I will have none of it. None you are of it. an insignificant speck beneath my notice. I have surpassed you in every way and accomplished what you never could. I have unleashed the full potential of this Rakatan factory. You had no idea of the power within this place. Its very walls are alive with dark side energies. And now, my old master, I will let the Star Forge itself destroy you. Oh, is that right? 
that's not good. Oh, that's not good. Oh, that's bad. Oh, no. Oh, hey, guys. How you doing? Okay, that's bad. It's just gonna keep. Okay, wait. Can I move? I'd very much like to move, please. Uh, let's see. Oh, here we go. Just enough to get another droid to help. more
I hope I didn't soon waste like my because it's still spawning some. Okay, I think I get it. Okay, I think I get it. So, depending on how many you destroy, it'll generate a spike for that one. Which then I could use to, uh... destroy the, uh... the builder. Very nice. Oh, Man, I did a whole bunch of walking today. Oh, great. Now I can't move. And then exit game. Load. That's what I thought. So, I'm gonna put uh, one of these on. Well done, Revan. I was certainly the defenses of the star. Right, see, so there's more of your old soak in you than I expected. You are stronger than I thought. Stronger than you ever were during your reign as the Dark Lord. Did not think it was possible. It is your last chance, Malik, for surrender. No, Revan. This time our confrontation can only end in death. Yours or mine. Once again, we shall face each other in single combat. And the victor will decide the fate of the galaxy. All right. Persisted, eh? <laughs> 
I am a man. You continue to amaze me, Revan. If only you had been the one to uncover the true power of this star. But you were a fool. All you saw was an enormous factory. All you ever imagined was an infinite fleet rolling forth to crush the Republic. You are blind, Revan. Blind and stupid. Oh, is that right? The Star Forge is more than just a space station. In some ways, it is like a living creature. It hungers, and it can feed on the dark <laughs> side. <laughs> See the bodies. These are Jedi who, who fell when I attacked Dantooine. For These all intents and purposes, dead, except for one Dantooine. purpose. For all intents and purposes, dead. Except for one difference. I have not let them become one with the Force. Instead, I have brought them Instead, here. Instead, I have brought them here. The Star Forge corrupts what remains of their power and transfers the dark taint to me. Oh. Well then. You cannot beat me, Revan. Not here on the Star Forge. Not when I can draw upon the power of all these Jedi. And once you are beat. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. Hmm. Well, that's annoying. You know, for a re you know, I put that one arm shield on for a reason. It's supposed to, you know, deflect energy and stuff and electrical and stuff, but it's just going right through me. Yeah. Uh. 
Hey, I did it first. Oh, he ran over there. You're so lucky I can't... I can't move at the moment. Screw you, Malik, dude. This fight is so bullshit. <laughs> it doesn't help when the game glitches out and I can't move to go do the other ones. Well done, Revan. I will. You are stronger than I. I have not let them become one with the force. Instead, I have brought them here. Me. The Starforge corrupts what remains of their power and transfers the dark taint to. <laughs> I'm trying to find how to make it through. Uh, okay. I'm just gonna be here. God, I can't move. Come on. Yeah. 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 
Hey, Glitch, you want to stop happening so I can actually move? That'd be great. Why am I not attacking? Jesus Christ, game. I really wish I could move so I can go get the other one, but no. Game wants to be a douchebag. And glitch out to where I can't move. Okay, you know what? I'm actually going to save right here. Just in case. Because I have made it pretty far. Long time coming, you think it's on around. That's the last one, so. That's fine. Shit, dude. Like, what's the point of doing all this extra stuff, but it's not helping me at all? Yeah. <laughs> 
Because I could see these scars, and what I want you to want, what I want you to feel, it's like no matter what I do, I can't convince you, just believe this is real. I look over and watch you, turn your back like I always do, face away, pretending I'm not, I'll be here to all that I got. <laughs> No, I'm dead. And dead. Oh, surprise, not yet. Watching you, turn your back like I always do. Pace great to ten and I'm not. I'll be here to well that I got. Ah, uh, damn it. Really? What kind of bull? How did that miss when I did the animation that I made contact? went through my shield in one hit.
God damn, dude, this is so fucking annoying. What kind of BS is that, dude? So fun. No shot. That last attack missed. Dude, Malik hacking, bro. Malik be hacking. Uh, 
Thank you, Jesus Christ! How hard was that? Oh my God! <laughs> Impossible! I, I cannot be beaten. I am the Dark Lord of the Sith. This is the way of the dark side, Malak. All things have death. The power of the light will always be stronger than the dark side. Still, still spouting the wisdom of the Jedi, I see. Maybe there is more truth in their code than I ever believed. I, I cannot help but wonder, Revan, what would have happened had our positions been reversed. What if fate had decreed I would be captured by the Jedi? Could I return to the light as you did? <coughs> if you had not led me down the dark path in the first place, what destiny would I have found? I suppose... I suppose you speak the truth. I alone must accept responsibility for my fate. I wanted to be master of the Sith and ruler of the galaxy, but that destiny was not mine, Revan. <laughs> it might have been yours, perhaps, but never mine. And in the end, as the darkness takes me, I am nothing. And dead. And that is the end of Malik. What happened? Darth Malak is there is no way to turn him to the light side. I had to kill him. I don't think anyone actually expected that he could be redeemed. I'm surprised you would even think of trying. There's no time to celebrate just yet. I was able to use my battle meditation to allow the Republic to break through the Sith fleet. The capital ships are in bombardment range. And that means we all have to get out of here right now before this entire complex comes down around our ears. Everyone else is already on the ship. Let's move. Let go. I I, I kind of like it. I like the um, aspect that since of how low health I was, I was my character was hurt. I felt like it was accurate to how the cutscene should have been of me talking to Malik and to them because you know, master and apprentice. So you know, obviously I I was weakened from the battle. I like the I like to think of it like that. That was lore accurate. You know, I love Lincoln Park, but I don't think this song fits the moment right now. <laughs> what is real? Boom. Mm-hmm, it's an... Lies. Admiral Dodonna, we've hit their main orbital stabilizers. Why is there up. music in the back? I don't want to lose any ships when that space station goes down. We've I don't... The Sith routed, like it. The Starforge destroyed. But at what cost, Admiral? Where is the Ebon Hawk and her crew? We alive, don't worry. We good. They will not heal. Confusion, why this real? Oh, snap, there they are. Cock, you made it. Couldn't let you start the victory party without us, Admiral. I'm sending an honor guard to escort you in. You'll get a hero's welcome when you get home. I find myself again. 
Turn walls is closing in. Right, oh, blah, 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 blah. Why is there music in the background? I really hope the later in the VOD this won't actually get copyrighted because I turned the music off. For this, I am proud to present you each with the cross of glory, the highest honor the Republic can bestow. Yeah. Yo. From Coruscant to the farthest reaches of the Outer Rims, you will be known as the saviors of the Republic. Blah, blah. Very nice. And I like how HK is just there chilling. On behalf of the Jedi, Jedi Council, defenders, defenders of, of the, the galaxy, galaxy, and sworn protectors of the Republic, I too would like, like to honor you for, for your actions. We Jedi right, now have another, another tale to weave. to weave into the grand history of our eternal, eternal altar. The redemption of Revan, the prodigal knight. Wherever you go, you will be recognized as the saviors of the galaxy, the heroes of our age. But you must remain ever vigilant, for one day you may be called upon yet again. Did I find the glory of the Republic? Republic. Indeed, indeed. Very nice. Good boy ending. No. Stop that. Yeah, music's off, so why were you playing music, game? But uh, anyways, we are done with the with KOTOR, finally, after so many technical difficulties, we finally finished it. And I really hope that there was really not any music being played in the background, because I might not be able to upload it to YouTube. I guess we'll figure it out once Devad is published. Um, so yeah. Hmm. What to do now? Hmm. That isn't that is a good question. What to do now? I guess we could end the stream real quick and then start it back up and start the second game. So that way it's easier for me to upload the VOD later. Nothing. <laughs> so let me move this back over here. Because the second game, it's actually going to be fully, like, full screen. So let me go ahead and disable this. Alrighty. So, for YouTube, thank you guys for watching this. You know, I've had so much fun, fun playing this game again. Um, so glad I was finally able to get out of work. And I was really upset if we weren't able to um, after that one point. But I'm glad it started working again so I could actually finish the game. You know, the last bit of the Star Forge and all that, that was annoying. <laughs> yes, it was. I'm not going to lie. But still my, my favorite game. One of my favorite games. And we are going to be starting the second game. Um, well, for us, for right now, here on Twitch, but for you guys on YouTube, no idea when that's going to be uploaded for you guys. I don't know when this is going to be uploaded. I think I just uploaded the six VOD, you know, six VOD the other day. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to start, a, start up the second game right now. So thank you again. Thank you all for that were here to watch this with me and hang out with me during this time. Thank you to the guys on YouTube, uh, you know, for watching the VODs and stuff like that. And I hope you enjoyed the journey over there. Um, I'm going to, but yeah, okay. So see you guys in a little bit and goodbye YouTube. See you in the second.